And welcome back to the Colonel Does Pace Race for November 2015. Our uh, theme for the month was uh, time travel. And this is my base episode. Um, <laughs> I needed a lot more black wool. <laughs> so I had to farm a bunch of these cow uh, these guys here. Uh, since I didn't want to collect all the... Um, all the uh, the ink sacks. So thought about killing them all. I've already gotten rid of the chests just to clean up. But um, anyway, we'll uh, <laughs> I'll leave that. I think this is actually outside the the scope of the base anyway. So we should be able to uh, just ignore those guys. Um, so this is uh, this is my base. Um, the cache was over here. And there's, oops, I'm sorry, there's the horse, uh, there's the old base, Cherry's old base, um, just over the hill there, and uh, so this is it. This is a clandestine uh, time travel -y thingamabob. Uh, all the windows are blacked out, you can see. Uh, it's made of iron, it's a little pillbox kind of a deal. And uh, it's a secret facility in the middle of the plains, and so we hop on in. And nothing going on except we uh, just fall into the minecart elevator here. And then we come out to the facility. Uh, for those of you who are into science fiction um, and of like science fiction y stuff from way back when, uh, you may recognize this. This is the time tunnel. Uh, it was a series in the 60s or 70s, I can't remember which. Um, I used to watch it on reruns a lot, and uh, it was kind of a cool episode. These guys would go into this time tunnel, and uh, when they came out the other side, they'd randomly uh, appear, and every time they went through, something blew up, <laughs> and they'd have trouble find getting them back. Um, it was kind of neat. It was kind of neat. I missed that show. Um, but anyway, this, so this is the underground facility, and we've got the quartz stairs. I think I've used everything uh, that we were supposed to use. Uh, use some of the iron for um, for these things here. I think it looks kind of cool. There's the water bucket in the middle. Uh, I did do some mining in the uh, in the Nether just to get some light glowstone so that we could light some things up a bit more, make it look a little more interesting than having torches all over the place. So spent some time there. Um, use the uh, some of the cash. I don't know if the, I'm allowed to do this or not. I use some of the cash to uh, convert the iron blocks back into iron and then make the trap doors. Uh, I don't know if that's allowed or not. Um, I'm going with it. There's too many rules. <laughs> I can't keep up, man. So this is my liberty here. Um, I use some of these, and I use the iron some of it for the uh, for this thing here to make it look nice. Uh, so we got a bed here, we got extra storage, uh, nothing in there, looks kind of cool, we got the black glass, uh, we got our three uh, pressure plates, we got uh, all of our, um, whatever this stuff's called, sandstone, uh, we got our decorative blocks in the corner, we got our granite in the corner, just to kind of make it look nice, we got our different woods, our oak and our birch. Uh, we use some of the spruce to make some of these uh, desks, computer desks, uh, with the monitors. <laughs> really derpy. Um, there's our oak, and uh, I went down and got some some redstone and uh, just kind of made some redstoney things. Uh, in addition to the the ten repeaters that we have. We got the redstone blocks in here, so this is the time tunnel itself. We got our coal. <coughs> Excuse me, a little under the weather. Uh, we have our brown, um, or I'm sorry, our black stained clay and our purple. Is a blue blue stained clay um, in here in the tunnel to separate the the different rings. Uh, obviously, we've got white wool for the rings. We've got our clock. Um, Originally, I was going to put a portal here with obsidian, um, but I don't have the... I didn't want to... <laughs> I didn't want to make the obsidian because I had to make all the wool for the walls, and I was going to light it on fire, and I didn't really want to go down and mine for any diamonds, so um, I just left it. 
uh, and probably in hindsight, it's probably better that I did that so that the, for the next month, um, you know, the guys, there wouldn't be some temptation to have a portal or I don't know, something like that. Brain's not working. Uh, so anyway, this is the time tunnel. So we would go through here and this would be in the back in time. Uh, so we've got uh, carpet, uh, dark gray carpet, and uh, so all of the extra blocks that I uh, were part of this build, I, I left underneath. <laughs> so we've got the, the extra birch, and we've got the, the polished diorite, and um, there's, there's a bunch of uh, oak under here, and there's cobblestone, and there's the, the gravel under here as well, so... Um, it's, it's there, but it's hidden. Um, I tried to incorporate all of the blocks into the same level that the, the wood is here. So, um, you know, if we go down two blocks, then, you know, all bets are off. But uh, for this level here, uh, just under the carpet, uh, all of the blocks sh should be apparent. And there's our jukebox there. So let me cover this back up. And should be lit up. I don't think anything can spawn on the carpet. Uh, and I've run around the edges, and everything should be should be spawn proof. Um, it took forever to make this. <laughs> it really did. Um, and then these are kind of. It's really hard. I'm gonna try and overlay a photo of what I was trying to go for. Um, it's really hard to do mainframes with vanilla Minecraft because <laughs> of all the blinky lights and stuff. So this is my approximation of a, of a mainframe. So uh, anyway, uh, and also we got our uh, half slabs here. And we've got enough of them here. And we got a bunch of them up in the, the lobby there. So yeah, this is, uh, this is uh, the build for the month. Time tunnel. And um, yeah, if you haven't seen me at the series... Uh, check it out, man. I think it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. Alright. Well, everybody take care. I probably should not go out here at night. <laughs> I'm going to log out here. Alright. Hopefully you enjoyed. Uh, if you have any comments or suggestions, please feel free to leave them below. And uh, I guess we'll see you in December. Take care.